people ask me if I feel more Chinese or Korean, I say both. Sometimes I crave the crunch and acidity of kimchi. Other times the juicy filling of a Shaolin Bao. And every time you ask me to choose between my heritage, you strip away a piece of my identity. And that same struggle of being mixed Asian is worse as an Asian American. People don't ask it, but they think, how American are you? Because it's okay to pick apart what kind of Asian I am, but decide if I'm wet enough for you. But I'm not like those other Asians. I'm from NYC. Knock out on the four train, steer clear of Times Square, and where to find the best combo of a rice. I'm not a whitewashed Twinkie or a broken English FOB. But then, what am I? Sure, I love two bros and bubble tea equally, but what am I, really? I struggle with this question every day, constantly riding the line between Asian and American, fighting for my place in society on a spectrum of white and black. Stereotyped as the model minority, the silent and orderly, the math geeks, the social freaks, the physically weak. And then I hear comments like, you're funny for an Asian, or I only hang out with cool Asians. As soon as one of us breaks the close-minded mold, we're treated like gold as if Asians aren't allowed to be bold. Just because my values are different than yours doesn't mean you can put me down. Don't make fun of me because in my culture we bow. My Chinese, my honor and respect, my Korean, my pride and discipline. I don't want to be afraid to be outspoken, not just the outsider or token. I don't want to forget my ancestors who fled to escape strife and give me a better life. I'm proud that I still take off my shoes when I enter the house. Yeah. Yeah. That I know where to eat barbecue in Koreatown and on Chinese New Year when I receive my home bow. Hey. People don't ask me if I feel more Asian or American, but if they did, I'd say both. Thank you. Woo!